When it comes to cattle producer education, we don't know when COVID-19 restrictions will be lifted enough to allow us to gather and resume normal activities such as field days that have always been a source of valuable information. Hopefully, these opportunities will open up safely sooner rather than later. In the meantime, we take a look back to last fall and one of the outstanding annual field days hosted by Kansas State University. Cattlemen to Cattlemen reporter Brian Baxter tells us this field day was focused on education for beef stalker operators. Each fall, over the past two decades, the Beef Stalker Unit at Kansas State University puts on a special field day where they share the latest research developments in the program. The KSU Beef Stalker Field Day is an opportunity for us to illustrate the results that we have generated from our research as well as to bring in speakers that uh, address a multitude of topics that are relevant for our beef stalker producers. Educational sessions during the field day touch on topics in the areas of marketing, nutrition, animal health, and technology. The goal is to give producers the most accurate and up-to-date information to help them get the best performance from their operations. What we're really trying to look at is relevance, okay? What is impacting our producers today? What could possibly impact them into the future? And what kind of answers do we have at our disposal to help them out with that? Uh, so we try to keep them right on the cutting edge, that they have that cutting edge ability above and beyond any other producer, hopefully within the United States, which really helps Kansas beef producers really lead the way. The producers that do attend the K-State Beef Stalker Field Day appreciate the opportunity, the exchange of ideas, uh, the opportunity to hear cutting edge information, be it the outlook, report that's provided by one of our very own in the Department of Ag Economics. And then we also bring in a variety of topics pertaining to beef cattle health, nutrition, management aspects, uh, all that are relevant for backgrounding and beef stalker calves. The Kansas State Beef Stalker Field Day is our biggest event of the year. It's just our chance to get to show off what we do here. The networking's awesome. So many producers come in, you get to meet so many awesome people and get those connections and get to see what's new out there. It's kind of a hallmark event, you know, in, in a 12 month period of time for stalker people that in the stalker cattle business in the state of Kansas and some come out of state. Very seldom have I ever been here when I didn't pick up some important information. Kansas State has one of the largest animal science departments in the United States and the Beef Stalker Unit is one of several field research facilities at this world-renowned land-grant university. K-State's really blessed with a whole array of livestock facilities, research facilities, on-campus lab facilities to support the research efforts and so, so those centers serve research, but they also serve things like today, which is really outreach, education, and sharing of research here at the Beef Stalker Unit. The Beef Stalker Unit here at Kansas State University is comprised of almost 1,200 acres. Uh, we have facilities to receive high-risk uh, long haul calves. We also have uh, native grass pastures, which allow us to do double stock, intensively graze studies once a year. Uh, it also allows us to conduct producer educational events and opportunities. So it's fairly close to campus and it allows us to really accommodate our goals at Kansas State University. I want uh, folks around the nation to look at Kansas State University and realize that we're leading the way into the future for our beef industry to increase our efficiency, our productivity, our well-being, everything uh, incorporated into one. That means a lot to me. Land-grant universities like Kansas State are a key resource for farmers and ranchers to get valuable technical assistance, educational outreach, and hands-on instruction. It's important for producers to look at all sources of information, but what land-grant universities provide are unbiased information and, and research reports that are generated using controlled studies in a fair environment to, to properly evaluate various treatments that are being evaluated. The best unbiased information sources is at land-grant universities, which is represented by professors at universities, in this case K-State, extension workers in the field. And so to me, yes, you can, you can fax check things, but then if you want them to help sort through the, the garbage and the truth, those are the people you need to talk to. 
From the KSU Beef Stocker Field Day in Manhattan, Kansas, I'm Brian Baxter reporting for NCBA's Cattlemen to Cattlemen.